good morning once again ano class so uh, today uh, to continue no our lessons ano uh, please paki open muna yung mga ano videos niyo i wanted to see no <laughs> whom i'm talking with but uh, again ano i would like to apologize for the uh, a lot of delays are coming in because of the technology yeah mishaps no pwedeng ako pwedeng you know the system whatever but nevertheless that's part of actually it's a very good uh, example of uh, how total quality management is coming along in this essence no so uh, what we are experiencing is a, a very good classic example of uh, total quality management in any process so relating our experience to today's uh, lessons the total quality in organization so i don't want to uh, no, no, to to have it in a, a negative light but apparently we it is manifesting you know a lot in the processes that we are experiencing based on the presented facilities and uh, yeah, resources that we have at the moment but i cannot blame anyone because right now we are on a trial and error basis yet and uh, we were caught unaware you now by the processes yeah because uh, it's you know inevitable for us to uh, come up or rather uh it's uh yeah actually you know so it's a trial and error in a sense that n everyone is not ready uh, it seems no so there so but nevertheless so uh, chapter two will tackle you know uh again you know, another areas that uh, we have missed in the uh, first uh, discussion that i've shared with you is the total quality in organization per se now uh again uh the key idea no as to, to, to continue on is that the consumer expectation have reason you know, in the context of uh, their expectation so uh, therefore a uh, the focus on quality has uh, permitted other key sectors of the economy even just to rephrase and you know, so most notably about uh, a very good industry example is the health healthcare systems you know, and the uh, uh, the education even just like what we are doing right now Camp, uh, organizations or non-profit like the uh, non-profit organizations are also uh, being uh, yeah, given emphasis in the total quality management context and of course the government the government as an organization and a system has uh, a lot of uh, processes uh, to improve on Saka ako na elaborate yan because I have my own experiences doing government ano as part of uh, yeah decision maker no in one of the government agencies no, yeah. being one of the board of directors no, of a uh, government agency so it uh, it entails a lot of uh, uh, yeah uh, quality in their management procedures including how to curb corruption. No, may mga ganyan. Alam mo, later on, you will be excited for what I will be sharing based on my own experiences. We, as BEDA, no? we as, a, as an educator of, uh, you know, uh, embracing our, uh, no, no, the, 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 the BEDA, uh, no, no, uh, uh, yeah, hallmarks. Uh, is nakalagay sa akin yan, you know? it's embedded in me, so I cannot just, uh, you know, join in any group or in any processes that would warrant uh, corruption issues in the government and that's part of the total quality management even so marami yan may kukwento ko sa inyo later on not now okay but nevertheless again and also let me ref uh, let me uh, uh, articulate on what system is all about no system is a function and activities no, that uh, within the organization that uh, has to work with together and be aligned with one another no okay so there uh, for example uh, a very good example is uh, McDonald's now when you say system in a production system uh, it composes uh, mainly you know smaller interacting uh, interacting uh, subsystems no when you say subsystem in McDonald's setup is that it includes the order taker, the cashier, the purchasing subsystem, uh, the training subsystem even. These are linked together as internal structures. So meaning, including suppliers even. So how 
these are the supply chains that goes well all together. As I said earlier, that uh, there is uh, no man is an island. So if you're going to be an, uh, in an edu in an organization, you have to work with all together. No, as one, one process, and one as a group, as a team. Otherwise, it will not function. So that is how where total quality management comes in. <clears throat> Now, the key idea there is that uh, successful management relies on systems perspective. One of the most important elements of total quality, you know, so the perspective of how. You know. For example, in a manufacturing system, uh, part of it, part of the system is the marketing and sales. You know. So that's one one. And another one is the product design and the engineering that includes the equipment and facilities. Next is uh, purchasing and receiving. That is most important. Uh, in a manufacturing system, you need raw materials. You need uh, yeah, supplies. No? You need uh, equipment. No? And these equipments are inevitable to fix up, to maintain. And, uh, yeah, and purchasing and receiving are one system that uh, goes beyond its functions even at times. No, hindi lang yan yung simpleng bibili ka and then you receive it. No, it doesn't work that way. In huge corporation, it needs it entails a lot of processes. It entails a lot of systems for you to be able to come up with it. Especially in the government, no, there are lots of. Uh, despite the fact that the government is very, uh, uh, how do you call it, strong in terms of systems of curbing corruption, in terms of, uh, yeah, purchasing and everything, but uh, you know. They, they can circumvent with the law. No? So if the government can do it, even private has the way to do it, especially in purchasing department, procurement department. No? Marami nangyayari po dyan. Production, planning, and scheduling is also part no, of the administrative function. So how important it is. And also there, uh, later we're going to be articulating it. And then the manufacturing and assembly is part of it. It is already, after the planning, the implementation of the process. Uh, so that is manufacturing and assembly. Okay? Just like making t-shirts. Just like making garments. No? So from the planning, from no, sourcing of the materials that are needed after the plants, you now try to uh, control no, the processes. And then after controlling, you implement. After the implementation, that's it. No? So the quality checks are, you know, in process even. Okay, uh, uh, the manufacturing system actually are being tooled and strengthened by a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of uh, systems that could uh, strong, strongly, uh, uh, you know, hold their function. So, tool engineering is part of it. Engineering, because it's a process. And then industrial engineering and process design are being engaged in huge no industrialized manufacturing companies and finished goods and inspections the way that that i'm telling you is part of a, a very good uh, process of uh, yeah, validating if you have generated uh, an acceptable product for your intended customers okay packaging of course shipping is also important because uh, and warehousing is important uh, uh, one, exi uh, one exciting uh, no, no, I just wanted to, uh, to, to, to share with you uh, prior to teaching I have worked with a manufacturing company and marketing I'm part of the marketing of a manufacturing company of an international brand at the time prior to teaching so it was about uh, 15 years of my experience there now how, how, uh, how do we go over it now as part of the marketing we recommend the merchandising department one one part of system the merchandising department uh, we give feedback on what sells in in the luzon besides in mindanao what garment what t-shirt what polo what pants what colors are desirable to these di di different demographics remember luzon besides in mindanao and department stores that the malls that we know of right now so i was in the market prior to uh, this and, and then uh, for you to be effectively you know, convey you know, the sales and then uh, eventually 
get a very good uh, you know process of uh, selling and marketing your product brand awareness and uh, product uh, product knowledge is important now when you say product uh, knowledge is important is that uh, the engineering and the process of the design process, design process are has to be systematic you know? in the factory that we went into our factory at the time merong cutter you know, the line for cutters uh, nagle layout muna ng mga tela no? and then equipments are you know fitting in taga cut after the patterns but uh, it is being done not manually but uh, equipment no so that equipment will now be forwarded to the sewers so kakabit ka bintana no from the left part to right part back pocket right pocket loop holes belt loop zippers and everything so uh, those are the processes that a lot of lines in a factory are being uh, this uh, no, engineered engineered rather no uh, fa efficiently designed to fit in all together so nakita nyo no process one two three and four and then fitting it together the finished goods are now being inspected and then after being inspected the, these finished goods are now delivered at the warehouse no for sorting stock number one number two color number one number two size number small medium large so, so these the warehouse are taking care of it now the sales we sales we go outside we take orders we send the orders to the manila office for shipping and sorting no? so they sort no ilang ilang piraso ilang anong color anong size and then once they have sorted out accounting process ilan ang in, ilan ang based on the PO the purchase order we reconcile ilan ang available sa inventory in the warehouse the warehouse will now prepare ito ang maidi-deliver out of 100% 99 lang kulang ng isang piraso so the accounting process now will now prepare the vouchering what din nakita niyo ang sa lupa no now the vouchering right now will prepare the 4D collection processes no gagawa na yan ng statement of account. Padadala sa amin, punta ng uh, Sambuanga, Dava, Butuan, Surigao, Sibud, Bacol, at Iloilo. Sir, ito po ang utang ninyo. Ito ang babayaran ninyo. Things like that. So, we get the, we get the checks. And then from there, we check no, well, the status. No? So, that is how packaging, shipping, and warehousing is coming along. The, the the product is being processed here manufactured in manila with uh, administrative will take care of uh, of some of the processes that are needed packaging uh, accounting and all of those things preparation of the shipment and then pagbalik namin so besides mindanao collection and everything and then we bring back the goods here and you're talking about i started in the market in the 1980 wherein wala pang internet kagaya nito no matter how palpak the internet is but uh, apparently during those years no internet not even a cell phone in 1980 so they rely solely on us whatever we say manila office will pray sana anes yung aming managers outside you know what i mean that is how important process is oh, so na gets nyo no uh, it's a, actually I'm giving you a very good example of what I have experienced as such in a manufacturing system. Uh, this is not might ne uh, this is might not be com uh, complete uh, in the process, but apparently you see you know, the whole picture of it more or less. Uh, understood, pa? Or any questions so far? Pede hum pa ano? Thank you. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I need an assurance that uh, you are understanding where I'm coming from. <laughs> Thank you. Now, uh, okay, no. So what is important, uh, no? So uh, for you to be able to manage, no, the total quality management in a fact manufacturing company is uh, the traditional quality assurance. No? So what are these systems? No? Systems in a manufacturing which focuses mainly. Focuses mainly on technical issues, no. So technical issues such as the equipment 
reliability. And then the inspection, as I said a while ago, the defect measurement is important also. And mind you, no, and dami niya, no, and the process control, which apparently that I am telling you the process a while ago. Now, the defect measure is important, no, for you to be able to contain the cost of production. Imagine niyo, no, 100 lang ang kailangan, tapos 50 doon sira defects. So what will happen? Kawawa si uh, boss, no? Kawawa ang office. Kawawa ang factory because you're losing money out of it. Okay? So that is uh, how, that's a key idea, no? Quality in marketing and sales personnel are responsible for determining needs and expectations of customers, consumers at that time. So how do you do that? So important for research, no? And development. Uh, you should know the, the, the field. What sells in Luzon does not necessarily mean sells in Visayas. Sells in Mindanao. Uh, do you get me? The Luzonians hate red. The Visayan hate blue. The Mindanao hate green. You know what I mean? So, uh, you know, it's not absolute, but uh, I'm just conveying some thoughts. I know that there are preferences in terms of colors, in terms of size, in terms of, uh, you know, size, uh, you know, all of these things. Uh, you know, fabric, uh, you know, fabric design and fabric content. So, yun ang sinasabi ko sa inyo. So, but then, the marketing and sales would make sure that it's okay for the Visayan to wear red, that it's okay for the, the Sonia to wear green, and so on and so forth. Convince. No? The effectivity of sales and marketing personnel based on the activities that they will be introducing and engaging no, the, con the intended consumer. Okay po. Ayan. Mm. Ayan, thank you. Hoy Miguel, gusto ay bukang mag-aano ha, mag video because uh, yeah, very pleasant kayo eh, tinong mo. I like your I like your registry. Lagi kang nakangiti. Yeah, I like that. Pati ito si ano si si Bailon. Yeah. Anyway, hindi masyado. Ito formal kasi itong si Bagakay, Jana. Smile. There. Anyway, now, the product design, the quality in product design, si Cholo, tumawa na. Product design and engineering functions develop technical specifications for product uh, and production processes. No? So, yeah, na. So, for them to be able to meet the requirements and determined by the marketing uh, function. So, tama yan, na, nagko-collaborate na. The product design should be in conformance with the preference of the Consumers based on the feedback coming from the sales and marketing. Or divide, siya. So that is how no, the alignment now are coming in. Diba? And then, uh, mm -hmm. ano ba <coughs> Hindi ko tuloy ng mute, ubus Excuse me. Okay, the quality in purchasing. Again, a purchasing agent should not be simply responsible for low cost preferences. No, uh, time and again, uh, if you are going to be uh, the purchaser of a, of a particular company, you don't actually uh, prefer no mostly in most times low cost no in every purchases requirement, but apparently low cost what maintaining a clear focus on quality also. May mura pero quality. Di baling konting mahal but then apparently uh, it would uh, it would uh, prevent you no, from causing a lot of defects on your finished product. Mura nga. Tapos nung, nung, nung tinahin mo na, na you know, ma marupok or something like that, you know, so uh, it does, it's not worth it. I would rather buy a, 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 a more expensive uh, uh, raw materials and then when fitted together uh, defects are 100% free so yun ang, ano po, uh, yun ang uh, alignment yan. quality in production planning and scheduling uh, poor quality often result from time pressures tama po yun ano? and, and it's caused by insufficient, insufficient planning and scheduling kasi uh, minsan may orders ano? orders are most specifically, this bear month. In the retail industry, in the normal times, in the COVID time right now, 
we normally get the orders August, no? August lilipad na kami niyan besides yung Mindanao no? and then we cater to the department stores and they will order no advance order ang tawag dyan delivered on October September, October, November oh, so yeah, schedule dyan now as soon as we get the purchase order we send the purchase order to Manila o oh, order na yan ito ha 100,000 pieces, 20,000 pieces, and so on and so forth, schedule. For the production to be able to also project and forecast the production uh, requirements in raw materials and labor. Diba? Kasi marami yan, eh, pagkaber eh. No? Until January, it's, you know, heavily. No? Orders are pouring in based on, uh, yeah, no? Uh, based on experience and for, uh, for, uh, previous ano, no? performance in the market. Okay, quality in production, planning and scheduling is important. Okay, quality in manufacturing and assembly. So, technology and people are definitely uh, in handy dapat. Ano? So, all of these two has all go all together. You might have a very good no uh, facilities. You might have a very good uh, uh, equipment, but then apparently the one manning the equipment is not equipped, no, uh, in in manning that or in operating, no, the push buttoning, whatever is to be pushed, diba? Oh, but may mga gano. So there's certain speed, there's certain time, and there's certain timing, no, for that particular machine should be running. So it eh, yung po ang ano. This is the things that are needed, no, for from to promulgate it. Now. Ay. Okay, uh, quality in process design is also kailangan. Ano? Manufacturing processes must be capable of uh, producing output that meets the specification consistently. So that's for you to curb no? and then maintain a proper, uh, uh, proper uh, management, no? uh, quality management that are needed. Inspection and testing. How do, uh, yeah, in the in a finished good, how it has to be actually qualified even. So the purpose of which the final product is to judge the quality of manufacturing. So, so a while ago I've been telling you about the defects uh, before you deliver, no, the uh, the, the desired uh, orders for your customer. It has to undergo a, in a lot of uh, inspection for you to have a very good impressions from the market no per se yeah and, and from your customer service after the sale uh, is important ano? so we parang ano yan, eh? uh, service after the sale is one of the most important factors in the customer perspective uh, perspective ano? and perception of quality because you purchase something and you found out some defects you it's not fitted no the uh, you know there's a certain defects so therefore, for you to be able to maintain the trust of your customer, so do something. Once uh, that customer no, request, requested for a replacement, do it without any questions. No, once that customer has uh, you know something to say about negatively no on your product, address it, and that way the trust element for your customer will be develop alam mo natuwa ako no there's one incident in the US when the last December we were there I was there uh, to San Diego no uh, I have my classmate dinala ko dun sa one of the steakhouses no there and then alam mo parang medyo uh, nakakain ako no as at siguro mga one fourth of the, the laki ng steak ano the steak were talagang bonga sa if I may say. Pero along the way, parang nakita ko kasi what I ordered was medium well, no? So I ayoko ng well done but uh, medium well, no, a certain juiciness on the, you know, on the meat of the uh, steak. Nung when I wala lang, may parang nag-comment lang ako ng konti. Alam mo, the 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 the, the server actually sir would like to replace it, no? ni replace my god eh halos kalakati ni nakain ko it was replaced without any qualms without any further questions without any, she just wanted me to be happy so these are the kind of customer ah, i'm sorry 
of service, quality service, and management even, the reflection of the management, that uh, would be, I don't know, would warrant a very good impression coming from the customer like me. There are lots of uh, customers like me, angalero, uh, very pa fuzzy, you know, about, uh, fuzzy about things. Parang ganon, so there. Quality in business support ma uh, functions for marketing no so these are the business support functions who are these so a while ago i've given you already some uh, uh, yeah insights and who are these subsystem no uh, the finance and accounting is very much involved quality assurance in the warehouse and the manufacturing uh, you know uh, uh, checking out quality no and legal processes so legal processes is necessary in terms of uh, permits, uh, licensing, uh, you, know, uh, you know, collection matters, uh, customers that are not paying, uh, labor issues on human resource as part of the organization, marami, no? So these are a lot of uh, referencing as far as legal services is also part of the business support, okay? Now, the key idea in many organizations, quality is seldom considered in financial analysis and decision-making Mula lang, parang it was, uh, you know, neglected somehow in some areas. But uh, it is important to reconsider the importance of having uh, the, you know, the subsystem as that. And every manager is responsible you know, for uh, even observing and studying and improving the quality of the process. Isn't it? Because they are the one who's in there. They are the one who's in the battle. They see the process. They see what is lacking. They see what is excessive. As a manager, improving the quality of the process is important. And you are responsible for it. Now, product and services differs. No? So first, <clears throat> the quality in services. You know? A service is defined uh, any primary or complementary activity <clears throat> that does not directly produce a physical product no? so uh, that is the non-goods no non-goods part of the, uh, the transaction <clears throat> uh, customer and the provider for example haircut product by own or service considered class um, <clears throat> Berta me Berta Ajana Silva Service, no? Okay. Jana, thank you. So, there, no? As a customer, ako yung papagapit. Provider, si Jana. The barber, no? Parang ganyan. No? Sa masahe naman, ako mahilig ako kung pamasahe. Kasi tumitigas na yung mga ano ko. So, Cholo, you are the massage. Uh, ano, ano yun? Service ba yun? O product? You, service. How, why do you consider it a service? Okay, very good, no? Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, no goods manufactured. Very good, Cholo. You being the provider no, of the service. Ikaw yung massage therapist. Tapos ito naman si ano, ang, ako naman, ang iyong customer because I love being massaged by you. O, oh, ganun, ano? At babalik-balikan ko, no? So there are, actually, no, I, 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 yeah, there are requirements on a particular, of a particular co customer for a spa service, no? May mga gano'n. Natatawa na naman si Miguel, parang may ibig sabihin. Wala, hindi natatawa. Wala, no? <laughs> hindi, parang gusto mo rin magpamasahe, actually. Yes! In fact, in fact, mamaya, I will be getting, yeah, please, so, I will be getting, um, uh, yeah, the service of, it. meron dito sa subdivision namin, uh, ano siya, blind, masur. So, nagko-corporate social responsibility na ako sa kanya. At the same time, it gives me, no, it keeps me fit and healthy. Kasi, oo, tsaka kawawa. I mean, I'm not really kawawa, but uh, I'm giving, you know, I'm helping in in a manner in which uh, I'm giving him work. Uh, Di ba ang hirap ng, oh yeah, yung ganon, ha? So, in everything, siguro I come to the point we're in at my age right now, I, uh, you know, I seek the welfare of, uh, you know, I'm being selfless right now. I, I, yeah. So, kayo, okay lang, because bata pa kayo. 
But if you have excesses, please share to the needy. Okay? Nagiging emotional na naman ako. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Okay. Uh, critical, uh, okay. Uh, critical differences, ano, we now talk about the between service and manufacturing. No? So, ano yun? So, the customer needs uh, and performance standards are more difficult difficult to identify no and measure nihirap kayo no hindi mo masasabi no that customer needs and performance standards are actually you know it's uh, how do you call it inconsistent no there are lots of uh, requirements of a particular customer but sometimes nagbabago siya because service ganun nga siya you no know? uh, walang standards but it has to have a standard and measure no and then service requires higher degree of customization. O oh, again, ano? Oh, yun. Gusto ko minamasahe ako habang ginugupitan. O oh, yan, customization yun eh, di ba? Gusto ko habang minamanicure ako, ginaganan yun pa ako, ganun. Oh, so these are customization. Now, whatever the customer prefers, he fits within the bounds of the services that you render to it. And, malaking tip because I'm happy. Right? Parang ganun. Okay. Now, services are produced and consumed simultaneously. Totoo naman, di ba, sabay. No? While, you know, while, while, while you're eating the fast food, they kept on serving you. No? Parang ganun. They kept on, you know, asking you. Dito lang kulang eh, sa ganun. But, uh, in some first world countries, you know, they, the, the servers are actually very uh, yeah, uh, conscious about the food that you're eating. Are you happy with it? And they keep, on uh, yeah, they keep on checking you out if you're happy with the service or the food that you are being served. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, components of service system quality, you know, as another part is number one is the employee. Are they qualified? No, are they uh, skilled? Do they have uh, you know the the personal touch in service? No, and then the information technology in today's you no know, arena and genre. No, so employees and information technology is part of the components of service system quality. Diba? I remember dati nga, diba? Oh, I-relate ko lang, 1980, wala pang te- walang information technology except riding on a plane. At that time, uh, Philippine Airlines only is the one flying no, domestically for us. Kaya kilala na tayo. Now, uh, but after uh, the, 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 the advent of the information technology in our in the sales and marketing manufacturing, nawala kami nawala kami na bilang area sales managers you know what because at the time prior to the information technology they rely heavily on us collection orders all of those things no pag nasa Davao ako five customers department stores and then i will allow myself in my itinerary for about 8 to 10 days in Davao and then Five days, tapos na ako ng trabaho. So, my extra five days, nandadaya na ako. Nandadaya na kami. But then, hindi naman daya yan because, uh, in a sense, ano, kasi, nasa beach ako, nasa panglaw, nasa ano, kasi wala na akong gagawin. But, effectively, I was able to produce and finish my assumed, no, responsibility. Eh, since department store ang hawak mo, so, in, from time being, uh, you also work, no? Because you you join the sales force, you join the sales lady of yours. Na magbenta ka ro sa tindahan or check her out. Ano nangyari? Bakit hindi mabenta? Check mo anong problema. So you're still working and then enjoying it at the same time. Oh my God, no? So that is. But then when the information technology come in, comes in, nung, uh, it was already engaged, ano, in the system. Payment are now online. Orders are now online. No? Inventories are now being submitted no? online. 
Do you, do you know what I mean? Defects reports are now being submitted online. See? So, our trip for about 8 to 10 uh, times a year, nawala. Once a year, twice a year na lang. Eh, ang laki na nawala sa aming kita. Because the per dime, per dime alone, company pays for hotel, food, lodging. So, we'll be away for about a month. Huh? Doing the, the turns. Bacolo, Dilililo, Tacloban, Ormo, Mindanao, Bisaya, Surigao, Cagayan, Iligan na. You go around. Living in a suitcase. Living, tapos pagdating mo Manila, buwan sweldo, may commission ka. See? See the point? And then, all of a sudden, nawala. Once or twice a year ka lang. Because of the technology. And commissions, nawala. Because, you, less effort now for you to convince the customer to buy Kaya, lumayas na ako doon. I left for another. Yan. I joined up to the government at the time. So, that is how the components of service system quality is engaged. I hope na nag-enjoy kayo ha, with my own examples. Oo, no? Kasi that's the way how relate, I relate to the lessons. No? Because it happened. And that's my experience. O, parang gano'n. Now, researchers have repeatedly demonstrated uh, uh, that uh, when <coughs> service employee job satisfaction is high, uh, customer satisfaction is high also. So, relatable. Diba? You, you, you partake a good service, you receive a good commendation. At suke, maging suke yan. Diba? Bakit ba lumakas si Jollibee? Bakit ba lumag, lum, lumakas si KFC? You know? All of those things, no? Because they kept on researching and improving. They kept on knowing who their their customer customers are, no? The demographic, their wants, their needs, no? So once you have determined that, so therefore, you come, uh, you create systems, you create ideas, you create, you know, a certain way for you to encourage new customers and maintaining old ones, and that is total quality in service gets po. Iba ganun, ano? Yan. Now, uh, yeah, again, ano, uh, some uh, may see, you no, know, information technology as a bane, no, not a boon, bane and boon, no, rather, no, uh, kagaya sa profession ko dati, no, as bilang area manager at the time. Because, but then, apparently, not being selfish about it, so it's a, uh, it's a boon, no, it's a, uh, it's a, yeah, it's a boon for, for uh, the industry, no? Because the information technology is essential for mo a quality in modern service organizations. So, di di ba? So, the integration of this uh, is fast service, efficient service, uh, you know, determining the defects, no? Easily. So, these things, the process uh, are now being, uh, yeah, uh, kumbaga sa ano, gumaganda na, no? na, na fine-tuned. And once it is fine-tuned, so efficiency, total quality management comes in handy. handy. And speed no, is uh, the key. There. Sa healthcare, hindi, I will not tackle much about it anymore kasi healthcare, you know, it's a given. But then apparently, uh, marami ng, uh, uh, I would like to share lang, in one, the Institute for Healthcare Improvement. Uh, so, in 1999, the expansion of the Ball Bridge Award. So, it, the Ball Bridge, diba, na-discuss nung sa part 1, ano? Uh, so, these are the, if we, uh, ano yung Ball Bridge, ano? So, that, it measures. It's a, an award-giving body that measures quality. Now, ano, what are the basis, no? In the healthcare. Hindi sa field health, ha? Buisit yung field health. Eh. Sorry. But, uh, Quality issues in healthcare no, companies in general. So, uh, yeah, avoidable errors. no. So, you can avoid errors, but then apparently because of money, because of corruption, they come up with a lot of errors. no. For you to commit a lot of errors and then no, uh, put one over the others, no? most specifically, your patients. But suffer because of money. 
and then under utilization of services mga mandaraya no? so there there is dangerous actually no? so because it uh, yeah it put uh, the the patient in danger no and some other stakeholders even overuse of services no for you to yeah mga ganun. so that would cost you know, the uh, and detrimental to the welfare and the health of the patient and then variation in services even so there's no standard private hospital number one private hospital number two government hospital number three the first in you know processes so it varies in services even and that is the quality issues no part of the quality issues in a healthcare yeah. and although the national healthcare system as a whole uh, may need a sweeping overhaul but uh, many individuals actually are providing you know, uh, 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 providers have turned toward quality as a means of achieving better performance and helping uh, customers helping patient even uh, there was one time that I uh, uh, fortune uh, in fortune care no? yeah. uh, during the early buy can and buy uh, in, you know in their, co their collection is very much efficient no na hospital ako my god saka sinabi pa na ano, you have a pre-existing pre-existing uh, condition so meaning hindi kinover pero pag nung they did, pero pagka in collection ng sila ng collection pag kailangan mo na kaya i hate that fortune fortune care no Huwag na please kung kayo man may ari pa siya isa ka na no ganun <laughs> i have a very bad experience with the fortune care mga ganun so di ba mga ganyan okay so quality in education naman so what are the measures uh uh, the chat and the deaf ed uh, mantra of no child shall be left behind. No? Actually, meron yung ano, there is a quality in education. Uh, there is a, uh, the Bulbridge recipient actually no, are also part of the measures. Is no child left behind. Act. Uh, meron lo niyan. No? International pa. Now, uh, the quality kid principles are active involvement. Ito yung sa mga bata. You know, uh, these are, you know, the kindergartens and you know, the elementary basic education. So, active involvement of uh, whole school community should be also engaged no? for them to be able to come up. Iba yun eh, no? the participation of all the stakeholders from the principal, teachers, students, even parents. And some benefactors are also has to be engaged. Committed leadership by those who are manning it. System for continuous improvement should be engaged also. So, uh, Marami na, no? like uh, in today's uh, way of uh, you know partaking the operations of an education so information technology uh, can help a lot no? so just like what we are doing we just cannot stop we do things to hone and further introduce measures and new tech, uh, technology for us to be able to pursue education that system for continuous improvements environment that celebrates success so there are lots of factors, no? So, yun, so, saka na natin mami-measure yan, no? But then, apparently, right now, how? <laughs> no? Because we are limiting, no? In terms of movements. But apparently, there is, no? There's an environment that uh, could give us venue to celebrate success. And we will determine that as we go along and process ourselves into, uh, you know, uh, embracing what is happening right now. Especially in education. Now, business plays an important role in fostering quality improvement efforts in higher education. So, how? By transferring knowledge and expertise no, but on quality processes and implementation uh, practices. No? Not only in school, but the processes involved in, you know, in promulgating these uh, yeah, exercises in academic. Okay, uh, yeah, quality in small business and not for profit ng mga NGOs. So, slowly to adopt quality approaches. To, so, what are needed? Quality, general lack of understanding and knowledge 
about quality as has to be improved see because there are lots of uh, you know management that are actually lacking in terms of uh, the promulgation of equality management procedures why because they're, they're not really experts or they're not used to it or probably they do not have any venue to uh, hone learnings about quality management so there the general lack of understanding and knowledge about quality even the definition of which are actually uh, vague you know, on some other managers and administrators. Now, focus on sales and marketing growth is for, for small businesses, uh, cash flow and routine, and routine, I don't know, environmental uh, safety checking, not only firefighting, no, but uh, yeah, sales and marketing growth is also important. Especially right now that uh, there is a strong introduction of the online approach. To sales and marketing. No, kahit ako nagugulat eh. Ay, wala eh. Because, uh, you know, you veer away from the traditional knock on doors marketing activities. No, and that prevented you from a physical contact with your customers. So therefore, come up with a device. No, using technology to maximize that device to enhance, no, the marketing, uh, marketing uh, and sales activities of your <clears throat> product or business. Now, the lack of resources for formal quality system, you know, siempre goes, uh, you know, all together because of all the, what I have discussed a while ago, the laxity of those uh, facilities and the requirements would now, uh, resources, you know, for, for a failure would be on the formal quality system. If the resources is not being uh, you know, available in handy, Mm -hmm. Perhaps uh, the most important factor class in the successful quality initiative in small businesses or the startup business or the non-governmental business is the recognition of the higher level uh, management, you know, the CEOs, that quality focus can be beneficial and lead to achieving, you know, first of all, after the determination of uh, the goal of and the objective, the vision and mission of the company or the business. Important, you know. That's the guiding line and force for you to be able to sustain operation. No, no. Okay. Now, in the government system, in the U.S., they were federal, but here, the government, no? so the quality in the government system Number one is the quality institute. No, it has. Although there's a lot, there are, there's a lot of uh, you know policies, regulatory, uh, giving body in the government. But apparently, I don't know. Probably it's the uh, the character of a person. Probably the exposure of a person now is the problem. No? So therefore, the government are actually not very keen on uh, on the process of hiring people. I know the government right now has a very good uh, pool of uh, pool of uh, uh, talents and skills, intelligent ones. You know, uh, they come in handy. You know, kudos to the government uh, officials and uh, co uh, employees. And they are actually, I've seen it. They're really good, actually. Education, dedication. You know, committed to service. But then apparently there are others that are. My God, I don't know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I cannot say it, no? but uh, yeah, that is the quality institute should be instituted in some of the government uh, agencies. Okay, so important, no? so and the concept and principles are universal. It's not only here, but uh, worldwide. Character, moral ascendancy, the genuine service uh, and love for your country should come in handy, and that's part of the quality system. Then, no? in terms of uh, you know choosing the right people and the difficulty of course is another one on top of behavior and on top of character is the development of uh, infrastructure to make things happen in the government diba? I remember when you say infrastructure hindi lang naman yung mga bridge and it's not even that I'm not referring to that but apparently the process inside a government agency 
So I remember at the time when I started in the government in the in, in, in the early years, my God, puro manual, no? recordings are manual and everything because wala pang computer. So with the computer right now, so I guess, uh, yeah, it's, but then apparently because of the lack of resources, no money. So I see some of the local governments right now still, especially in Manila, uh, no, uh, I used to work in Manila also, no, local government. Uh, yeah. Nakita ko, yung kulang, no? in terms of infrastructure, information technology, wala, kulang sa computer. So, yeah, it doesn't come in handy. Because of the resources. Wala naman talagang pera. Okay? Difficulty yon So, that's, uh, yeah. So, uh, there. Uh, I think uh, I have uh, discussed, ano, uh, primarily, uh, some of the important parts of uh, chapter 2. So, therefore, uh, again, uh, thank you now for that, uh, for listening. So, later I'm going to be imparting some of the directions again of how you are going to be developing chapter 2 and some of the assessments that I will be doing again in chapter 2.